I would do if I wanted to create a new Google website. First, I would go to google.com uh, or just uh, search in Google, Google Sites. So in the address bar up there, it automatically will search for Google Sites for me because this is Chrome and this is also my Google bar. Once I've found Google Sites, I'll click on Sites. Now I'm already logged in with my username. If you're not already logged into your Google account, it's going to prompt you to log in right now. So you would log in, click log in, and then here you would have your create website uh, button. So you would click on create. When you name your site, I'd like you to use your first name and the first letter of your last name. Uh, However, if it gives you problems, you can add numbers uh, in your website address. So, for example, I'm Samuel Altrak, so Samuel A. Um, if it gives you problems, just add numbers at the end of this. Uh, I'm going to add numbers 1, 2, 3, C, uh, just, just to make sure that it doesn't give us any problems. I'm going to browse the gallery for more templates. Uh, Let's see. Let's see, over here it says classroom site. Okay, just for fun, let's try that one here, classroom site. I'm gonna select it at the bottom here in the blue button. And I'm gonna fill in the CAPTCHA, L-A-C-E-L-E-S. And now at the top over here, I click on create. All right, so it didn't like Samuel A123, so let's add some more numbers. Four, five, six. Uh, let's see if this works now. Create. Still not happy. Uh, let's try. Let's try Sam. Sam. Alt. One, two, three. Create site. It's still not happy. All right, so as you can see, I had to play around with the spelling of, uh, of, the, of the site name here until it finally accepted it. Now that it's accepted it, it says at the top over here, it's creating my website. So I'm just gonna let it do its thing now and create my website. Here we go. My website is now created and uh, everything you see here is the template. What that means is uh, there's already something they're written, there's pictures, it's all just showing you what you can do. Uh, of course, you're going to change this uh, and customize it so that it's, it's you, it represents you. And the way you're going to do that is by clicking on this pencil button up here, it says edit page. When you click on that, it allows you to edit anything you see on the page. So there's uh, all these different applications and widgets here that appear as gray boxes, which you can customize. Uh, what you do is you click on it, you click on the properties button and you change the properties or you delete it completely. Let's delete these, delete and delete. Let's change the tip here. Let's remove that to and change it to welcome. And let's type hello here. When we're done fixing up the page to our liking, we click save and it will show you what your website looks like. So now it's done saving. When you go to my page, which happens to be called Samuel, uh, it will say, welcome, hello. And uh, you continue editing, editing this until it's uh, the way you like it.